Hey Aquarius, welcome back to my place. As usual, speaks messages. Gypsy Witch Tarot. Sending you love all the way from India. Bharat Namaste. Let's start with the read, okay? Also, I have my Patreon, my PayPal, my store, and my membership, everything. And the links are easily available. Also, my Gmail is there to book private readings, okay? Uh, what else? I'm on Instagram. SASHE LLS SASHELS running. Thank you for actually joining everywhere and sharing the readings, okay? Um, okay, this message is coming as in like really clear and may feel a little cold, okay? But we are going to also figure out more messages. So the main message that I heard in first go was lust and betrayal. This came as in like, really like I just like was focusing and I got lust betrayal. Lust and or lust betrayal. Someone got this. Or someone found out that it's kind of um, it's a, it's kind of like the track or, or, or the feelings or the track of feelings where someone figured out you figured out they figured out I feel like you figured out that the person was not genuinely interested rather their intentions were rude cold and just out of desires physical desires sexual desires uh, lusty desires okay it's not no, it's not love it's something that they wanted on certain kind of basis or base there was no genuine or authentic uh, base but it was like fake base or something that's it's kind of like you felt as if like it's a scam happened some of you might have gone through this situation possible way back and now you are in a position to know or to to go with your intuition and like just you figure it out in one go while you see the person or while you talk in one go that what this person is exactly zero two 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 recording time exactly want when you add in two 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 it's six something that is connected with your harmony your peace but also something or connection that you got into way back and it doesn't necessarily mean that you got physical okay but it may just mean that they talked about all that lust okay and you thought that they were like they were trying to build something with you but it was it was not something you recently possible found out for some cases you may have got little physical because it depends on timelines okay and then you found out that this was like it's a love betrayal rather it was yes it was out of lust but it was not love it was lust betrayal so for some of you this is the message um, and then yes of course you you just you are figuring this way out or you figured your way out and now you're healing possible okay and some of you yes got healed um, some of you right now know that all right if I'm talking to someone but your intuition is telling you that um, this emotion or emotional involvement is not getting me anywhere or won't get me anywhere so then you should either stop or if you have that thing that you can handle this like just for a moment you're talking you know it depends on person to person I cannot tell you stop talking no it's you it's your karma be responsible for your karma if you are figuring some way out or you're just figuring out a person possible and something is telling you to stop then you stop okay I won't tell you to stop I'm just a messenger and I'm going to give you the message because I can feel here that you may you, you may end up, you know, talking to someone here. Some of you. This is a page. Mm, this could be. <clears throat> this could be someone. It's kind of like you are. You are on. Um, what's that? You've completed one lap, okay, while running. So it's someone who enters in your lap while you are running, and they join your race or they join your run okay and then you're talking and 044 for recording time and that's it's going to be happening in your fourth lap or let's just say it's, a, it's something connected with the fourth time possible you, you're just giving chance or you know 
taking chance let's just say that it depends on person to person but what i feel here is that you're just figuring out some of you are finding stability and while finding stability we are on the run and we are running and taking care of ourselves and all this stuff right okay but yes i feel like that you are you're going to end up you know text message or something there could be particular reason for that like you just figure yes there could be a particular reason maybe you miss someone in your life just just any anyone like you don't know who is the one but you just miss someone i know it's going to make sense so you end up talking or um, with people with friends or with colleague or and it and to get rid of that kind of disappointment or something is a good idea um, maybe you will become good friends okay sometimes it's about something that we people just stop no this is not possible but we can talk i can see sweet good talks adorable affectionate talks i can see that it's in the moment um this could be some reaction this could be someone's compliment this could be something that you're going to feel good in the moment and i keep hearing the moment of your life kind of like this is like actually i can hear the tick 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 i can see the clock the wall clock yes i can see it's smiling at you i don't know how but the clock is smiling at you as of like the time is smiling at you they're saying like darling live in the moment okay don't stress they're saying that don't stress um that's what i'm hearing right now look at this knight of cups so it's something it's the presence of someone um this could be new beginning of something new development of a friendship and i feel like expectations only hurt us so if you have least expectation and you're just not thinking about oh we're going to get married you know it, it happens so if you're not in fast forward rather you are on just play okay and you're just going with the flow and you know where to stop when to stop who to stop and it's okay and you people are getting to know you get this like so i feel like it's okay it's all right you know when to stop right so yes there's a development of possible new friendship here i can see positive in this okay and maybe that message was totally different of like a uh, lost and betrayal that you've gone through and because of that you've like you know got like um experienced in this way of like okay i'm not going to like look this look at this you know when to stop you know when to move away from a certain situation there may be a cancerian let's see um i don't feel like using this deck today but i don't know why i'm holding this and why am i taking out cards maybe because there is someone you still want to hold on to or someone you want to hold so that you figure that out even if you don't know whether you like this or not like maybe development of something kind of I see a new picture. Three of Wands. What is that you desire the most? And I'm having hiccups. What is that you desire the most? What is that you are seeking? Um, and I keep remembering always, and I am mentioning. I've mentioned this in one of my readings, previous ones. That uh, someone over here is a seeker, just like in the Harry Potter. Harry Potter was a seeker, I suppose, right? On a broom, and he won. and i feel like yes that i feel like you're seeking something still not done with that but i feel like you're seeking something and it's all right while you're on the on the go on the, in the process um 0909 recording time you i feel going to connect with someone and there could be geographical distance as i said something is connected with three as well in your life um could be distance could be uh, could be the third time connection could be something totally new in your life but there's a voyage and i heard like description this description is still not like properly written here it's kind of like short and sweet so it's kind of like voyage that's it your description is voyage what are you going to do on this like you are going to enter i'm sorry you are going to enter in the main like stream and ocean and you are just going with the wind and 
let, let it start and then you're going to know and you're going to figure that out while you're on your exploration that there are so many creatures you haven't seen while you were on the land it's kind of new voyage brings new experiences just like in emotions and everything um, and I would say especially after like lust betrayal cheat however this fits your situation you know now what to do I feel like if that never happened this wouldn't be so interesting journey I know the pain is pain you people go through that we all go through that but you know now what to do where to move right uh, oh my god I, I keep hearing ocean sounds I keep hearing siren that you shouldn't go there I was like in I was lost just for a moment I was like I, I felt as if like I'm on some ocean in some ocean on something like a voyage I felt that strong here like I, I feel I felt like heartbeat is getting fast Ooh. I felt like heartbeat is getting fast okay oh my god Ba, ba, ba. Okay, two of cups. Get serious, get sincere, okay? So I feel like this is going to be the voyage of a new connection. Some of you, this is someone you're going to reconnect. For some of you, you're going to get closer, C-L-O-S-E-R, with a certain person here. You will figure the emotions of each other and you will know about each other and 12 12 recording time this could be your twin this could be your soul soulmate however you want to name that but this is something deep all I can say even, even if we never had those words of twins and soulmates I feel like of course we have soul so we know that okay this is my soulmate okay but even if you you don't know about these terms you never heard about them just just imagine you never knew these words then also you feel some connection the the pull the the inclination this is what i feel here as of like um, two energies are dreaming about each other uh Two energies are dreaming to get close to each other. Two energies are dreaming to cuddle each other. Um, it's kind of like with the flow of life, it's kind of like life after life possible in this life. Maybe it's your third life as human species, yes, on this earth. And you're going to now find each other. If you never found in your previous two lives, sort of it depends just we can talk about that so something is magical and mystical about this union whether it's a reunion or whether it's union whether it's like for the first time or, uh, there was uh, in notification there was 3 p.m. something is connected with 3 that's why I was like uh, what Okay, I know you. They know you, you know them. Um, it's kind of like what's that word? Uh, that you that you remember someone even if you never met them prior in this life. If it's for the first time, you'll remember suddenly. Uh, recognize you'll recognize someone in this life going to be something turning in your favor there's someone who is dialing your number whether you'll exchange numbers or whether it's already with you you people are coming close it's the next wage I also feel like maybe for some of you not for everyone this connection is us with someone who is already in a connection as well and I know it doesn't make sense that they shouldn't do this like kind of I don't know but they're feeling a pull towards you okay or you might be 
or this is totally new and there is a wheel of fortune turning a turn of even events you know what again i got a notification and it said phone it said phone and some other things were there but it's phone i said you you someone is going to call you you're on phone you're talking to them mm. The lovers, Gemini could be. This could be the love story that is going to build or develop. It's somebody you're getting a pull, getting involved. Yes, physical attraction as well. Someone who may be in a current, maybe in the current relationship. If it's not you, they are. Or this may be totally someone who wants to get close to you. This is um, I can. It's, yes, it's desire, and this is very exceptional desire. It's, um, it's exceptional desire over here, I can see. When you feel like no, never, like for example today, I thought like no, not this deck, but then still we're figuring out from this deck only right now. Um, like to no, never, to, to yes, I can talk, or yes, I would. Yes, I would. This is a 50-50 situation, kind of. Something is, something that's over. Yes, this makes sense. Something that's over. You're out from a past. And it has, it has to do individual journeys as well. Something that you are out from the past. You're not... Uh, entertaining that you're away from that you look at this you you're away from that you are away from lust and all those things betrayal and everything you've moved in your journey okay uh, one thing some of you may get in contact means they will try it depends on you whether you want to you know literally entertain that or not because I feel some may try to get in contact with you if you don't it's a cut okay it's a cut the crap Second, it's something that is, that's not a repeat of your past relationship. Um, something that's not going to be wounded. Something that's going to be uh, welcoming. I feel like you're not going to get hurt or you're not going to have any possible right now attachment or something like. But I feel like it's also some kind of connection which can go in extra. I mean, if this person is with someone, why they're talking to you, you'll figure that out. But why they want to, you know, involve themselves with you. There is some kind of movement or something that's going to go ahead. Now, there are many things happening, like kind of like, so you need to be very careful in what you get involved in. But there is someone you're getting um, some kind of emotional kind of satisfaction. But you, I feel like you've never been in physical contact with this person, like, never been physical but somehow they want to offer you something you always need to know on what basis but yes ace of pentacles this could be someone who works with you but i feel like they're also trying to convey that you need to know something about them if they're totally like they work around like they work in that organization never been friends but if their interest is with you you need to know about their past or you need to know about their present you need to know if they are currently in relationship because sometimes people offer something and they don't literally tell you what is going on and there's a middle part to that so you need to yes no not then what is coming for aquarius i feel like you're talking to someone uh, or you will talk i feel that strong um, and this talk is literally like kind of like hmm, to break the monotony look at this boredom it's a word written here but I said monotony four of cups is offer for how long for what purpose that you need to find out this could be someone who is uh, masculine who is a Gemini Libra Aquarius or could be feminine but let's see what is coming oh yes this is something out of the blue. This is someone's uh, presence that you're going to enjoy or you would love to enjoy, but it's reverse. It's not a specific, it's not a specific um, 
kind of like so sure or assured of her. But there is something, a magnetic pull. Uh, I would say it's something for some, not so promising. Right now it's not looking so promising. I won't say that. So that's why I told you that to figure out what is going on in this. Okay, things are going to happen. You may end up talking, you may get involved, but you need to figure out what is on the, yeah, like the back um, stage, what is going on. So I also feel that monotony will break still. Four of Cups energy, okay? Monotony will break. There is a playful energy around you that you people are going to enjoy the time with. Sometimes when we talk to someone, we get to know ourselves more. What we should do, what we shouldn't do. No. What is coming for Aquarius? Mm. Not satisfied. Please give us the flip. So this works. Okay. As I said, that boredom will break, like it's going to monotony will go away. So you got Knight of Pentacles, could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. But this is what the energy is, loyalty, okay? Your journey is heading towards, like you want to be loyal to your work. Some of your new work will start. Some of you will see something shining, okay, entering in your life. Some of you will know this person and I feel like they are loyal in a way of like they're truthful it's just not your self journey it is something that you're going to start now I hear as if like there is a longing but also this is something connected with long time to come which is longevity I, I think it's longevity not longevity it's longevity okay so something that is going to move like go in future direction this could be a new companion coming along it's something that is going to be constant. It's not something that's going to be past, which is a good sign. Okay, so if you're building something new in your life, whether work or relationship, this is what is good about. And nine, nine of swords is anxiety here, the words written. Something or someone's presence will let you come out of this anxiety or some kind of nonsense or drama that someone caused in your life. It's kind of like a consistent, a constant talk, a connection. Let's just say connection. Every now and then it picks up uh, and it breaks the monotony. But it, you know about them, like kind of. So someone who is going to send you the message I see here, okay? And it's going to break the anxiety that you might be caught up in or something that you're overthinking. Uh, sometimes when we talk to some energies, they may not be so permanent in our life, but at least they are like constant as you talk to them. You will figure out a lot about other energies. You figure out a lot about your own life. Uh, this is a learning process as well at times. Okay, so here I feel your anxiety will go away. I can tell you that, okay? Some kind of, whatever kind of anxiety you have. Let me see what is coming. Something. Some of you, yes, what? No, they're saying just stop, just take out cards. But why you want me to stop? What is coming for Aquarius? They want me to stop, is because of two of swords? They're saying that you are not responsible for everyone and anything, for everyone around. You cannot please everyone all the time. That's what they're saying. Okay, and this is what you need to know. Like you need to break, you need to put yourself sometimes in silent mode before you proceed with anything. You need to take a break. This is your own break. Okay, so, um, 
I think like just you're coming out and you're figuring out about your own things right now. You may not be in the situation or let's like just say you're not in the mood to break the silence right now, which I feel like you're confused for a bit here. But I feel like someone is approaching with something in their mind. Knight of Cups. Now, uh, you may be in the maybe. You may be thinking about, should I talk? Should I continue this? Um, should I should I reply? Kind of like, is it good? Okay, for me. Some emotional development is there in you. Should I? What is the right thing for me? You're confused. But I feel like with Seven of Cups reversed, you're going to be fine. You are going to be in more decisive mode, okay? Yes, you're connecting with someone and you like talking. Um, this is to remove confusions. This is to also, this is some someone you've blocked. Literally. You're not talking to them. For some of you, this is the case. Okay, this is the case. You've stopped receiving anxiety from them and entertaining like boredom so you are working on yourself not getting wounded again five of pentacles here okay looking for a new thing some of you are looking for a new job or you have received like confirmation or something uh also this is money coming in some kind of booking it's a heavy booking heavy money coming your way for some of you okay um I won't deny that something is confusing over here a little bit. Maybe because maybe with the one you're talking. Okay, but when you talk, you'll figure someone out. I feel like when you talk, you'll know more about them. So if it's like if you're blocking yourself, no, no, then you'll never know. Okay. So if you just pull that those words and remove that blindfold, you'll know that uh, okay, this is the way to figure this person out. Maybe you need to research or you know know about this person more. Uh, via social things what they do activities and you'll know oh nah or yeah like kind of like exciting no then just stop take care and see you soon bye bye okay it's not stopping